Hi, my name is Renee Dominguez. I am 22 years old. I live in Austin, Texas, and I am a content creator. I wake up pretty much every Monday not really knowing what my week looks like. Um, right now with Nine Banded Whiskey, it's a little bit more structured. I go, at least I go to an office Monday through Friday. Um, I go to Do 512 Monday through Wednesday um, right after Nine Banded, and then whatever events pop up. Um, Nine Banded does do a lot of events with music, so I love that. But as far as um, going to shows, it's all pretty random. It's all very up in the air. I'm a very laid back person, so I don't really need a lot of structure. I'm pretty much just down to do anything. If someone asks me to go take a picture of them performing that night, um, that morning, and then I'll just I'll do it. So I try to keep my schedule as loose as I can. Um, I don't have a lot of free time anymore, but that's okay because a lot of the jobs that I am doing and a lot of the work that I'm doing right now is fun for me and it doesn't feel like work. So yeah, sometimes I try to play with my dog in there. Um, she doesn't live with me anymore, but yeah, I just go visit, make time for friends, <laughs> try to live a normal life, but not typical anymore. So, I'm standing outside of Stubbs, uh, waiting to get into the nightcap show. I'm here to take photos of them. And I was hired by the band uh, through a friend. And this is the earliest I've ever been to a show. How do you get there? Yeah, standing in line, waiting to get in. Usually come later once the crowd has settled. And I don't like waiting for a band to start, so I know that when door when it says doors, the band doesn't go on for like 30 or an hour later, so I don't like waiting. So I usually come later on, but I wanted to get a good spot, so I'm here early. way to just practice on my video making skills and just an extra thing for them to have. I already edited the pictures I took of them and sent them over probably the next day. So getting to the show was great. Uh, I usually park at Whole Foods and walk but just decided to head to Stubbs this time and see if I could find some parking and luckily I did right in front right outside of Stubbs which never happens. Um, but I did have to pay, which always happens. Uh, it was cheap, but I still don't really like to pay for parking that much. But they, the band was paying me, so that gives me more incentive to pay for parking. So I pretty much stayed in the front the whole night. Didn't really move around a lot because there was a lot of people close up to the stage. The whole night was a bit of a struggle with lighting. Um, Stubbs and Doors does not have the best lighting. Sorry to the Stubbs lighting technician. But all in all, after editing all my pictures, I really liked them. I decided to do mostly black and white. And some, I added some colors in there, so I liked that and I added those. And then I sent them all to the band and they liked them. So they said that they would have more shows coming up and they would need help with those. So hopefully we can be in touch. Overall, I feel good. Overall, I feel accomplished. Um, I feel excited for the future and to see what else they have in store. Um, usually, once I shoot a band at their show, then that starts talks of portraits and yeah and band portraits and like 
maybe even behind the scenes um, recording shoots so hopefully we'll see some progress from there and I got to enjoy great music they were a really great band so always my favorite thing is just to go and take pictures it's always what I remember it's like even if I didn't like my pictures I still got to do the one thing that I liked the best is to go out and listen to live music Thank you, Vlad, for playing trumpet, whatever you want. Thank you, everybody, for playing Vlad.